Welcome back to Cooking with Aliyah. Today I decided to go outside to one of my favorite places. It's a farm that's not far away from where I live and it's gorgeous, especially in um, autumn with all these wonderful colors behind me. And I thought I would share the scenery with you. So enjoy! kitchen and let's make some briwet with goat cheese. To make the briwet with goat cheese we will need spring roll pastry. In Morocco we usually use pastilla dough but it's very difficult to find it outside of Morocco. But the spring roll pastry is very similar to the pastilla dough. 9 ounces of goat cheese. Make sure you take the creamy goat cheese. One egg yolk, a quarter of a teaspoon of pepper. I'm not using salt because goat cheese is already salty. However, taste your goat cheese and you can add salt to your taste. If you like the sweet and salty taste, you can dip the briwet at the end in honey. So for one recipe, you can use just honey. And if you don't like the sweet and salty taste, forget the honey and add chopped parsley and hot chili pepper to the goat cheese for the filling. And we will need oil for frying. In a bowl, mix the goat cheese with the pepper and the egg yolk. I separated the mixture into two halves. If you're going to use the honey at the end to dip the briwet, leave the mixture as it is. If you don't like the sweet and salty taste, add hot chili pepper and chopped parsley to the mixture. To roll the brewet, you will need the filling, the spring roll pastry, and two egg yolks to close the brewet. The spring roll pastry dries up very quickly, so make sure to cover it with a humid cloth. Fry the briwet on very hot oil. Once the briwet are golden brown, remove them from the oil and let them drain. Add honey to the briwets that are filled with only goat cheese and egg yolk. Serve the briwet immediately. Bon appétit! <laughs> 